Okay, so the final nerve in the segment of the upper limb series is the auxiliary nerve. I know all of you are tired, there's a lot of information, but this is the last one and probably one mm -hmm. of the most simple ones as well. So if we just go over to our volunteer over here, I've drawn out the auxiliary nerve. So the auxiliary nerve originates from the posterior cord of the brachial plexus with the radial nerve, if you remember, if we go back to it. So after it's come off the posterior cord of the brachial plexus, it goes into what we call the quadrangular space. And the quadrangular space is actually bounded uh, by the teres minor, teres major, superiorly and inferiorly, medially by the medial side of the humerus, and laterally, I'm uh, sorry, medially by the long head of the triceps, and laterally by the medial side of the humerus. So you've got the auxiliary nerve coming through that space with the posterior humeral circumflex artery. And as the auxiliary nerve comes out, it then goes and supplies the deltoid muscle, which is this muscle over here, with its anterior, lateral, and posterior segments. And it also supplies, so that's the motor supply of the auxiliary nerve. And after the motor supply, it also gives the sensation to what we call the regimental badge area, which is just over here. Thank you very much for listening. We're then going to go on to how to test for the auxiliary nerve.